A driver ran over that man Sunday in the parking lot of the Maharaja Food Mart on West 2nd Street. And new tonight, a Xenia police report has identified Charles Stevens Jones as the driver. News Center 7's Brandon Lewis is live at the business in Xenia. And Brandon, you talked with the owner about this. Gabby, that's right. This all happened in the parking lot here at the food mart. According to a police report, the suspect stole lottery tickets from a speedway about five minutes up the road and then came here. The store manager said this surveillance video showed the suspect enter the food mart Sunday afternoon before three and go up to the counter. A different angle showed that person talking with the employee behind the counter. According to the police report, the suspect asked for scratch off lottery tickets and left the store after getting them and not paying. The report said the employee went after the suspect and 911 callers explained what happened next. I just saw a car run over the owner of the gas station. I said he needs help right now. He's not doing yeah, well. They're coming. The police and the ambulance are coming. The report said as the suspect drove away, the employee fell to the ground and was run over. You know, he wasn't going to say anything bad or mean or, or he just wanted to know, you know, if there was a misunderstanding with the tickets or what was going on. The Food Mart's owner told me this is a family business and the employee who was hurt is like an uncle to him. They call him Gopal and he's worked with the family for years. Very nice guy. And you come in and you're short on money, change, anything. He'll, a lot of times he'll take it out of his own pocket and he'll pay for something. So he's a very, very, very loving guy. Kumar said Gopal is at Miami Valley Hospital with broken bones and injuries to his head, but he expects him to be released sometime this week. The way his injuries were, I think if he would have had one step forward or back, it, it could have resulted in, you know, a pretty, he, he would not be here today, honestly, if, but, you know, we're, we're very thankful that he, he's okay. And Kumar just wanted to thank all the customers who called 911 yesterday. Also wanted to point out that we checked and we saw that Jones is in the Greene County Jail on theft and felonious assault charges. The police report said the suspect did not remember hitting the victim. We're live in Xenia tonight. Brandon Lewis, New Center 7.